Welcome back to episode eight of Shop Life with Patrick. Let's get to the shop. It's Monday, let's do it. All right guys, so today, uh, nothing on the board just yet. I think I'm gonna go through and just do some general cleaning. I'm gonna clean out the ball spinner today. Also empty out the bucket that's underneath it. Not really much going on today per se. And yeah, we'll see what happens. We have a ball damage. Uh, it looks like we have a few scratches here and there. Oh boy, okay. Uh, this is gonna be a multiple stage process here. This person is not gonna see their ball for a few days because these three are really deep. I'm gonna have to plug them all separately. Same thing with this one. Oh, here's another one. That's fun. Oh, there's another one. Oh my God, this is like all gonna have to be plugged. Okay, well, uh, let's call this person because it's gonna be a multiple day process. So we have the four bars that we started working on yesterday, so we're gonna cut this weight hole down, cut this thumb hole down, resurface this whole ball, resurface this whole ball. Plug spot number one of this ball is done. We're gonna move on to this one. Uh, this blue actually came out really nice and really close to this blue, so I'm really happy about that. And then we have this ball that we're filling completely. So we're drilling a ball for Mr. Josh here. Uh, I've drilled Josh maybe like six or seven balls all one-handed. Josh, what are we doing today? Uh, we're changing my game completely here and I have no idea what I'm doing. Josh is going to two-handed, so we have his two-handed positive axis point now. We're also switching him to vacuum grips. So we're doing a whole bunch of changes in one day. We're going with a dynamic swing pearl because this ball is absolutely money. So we're gonna get to drilling this and yeah, seeing what he can do with it. So we're switching Josh over to the two-handed gang. I've drilled him tons of stuff, so I know how he likes things to roll. Uh, so the layout that we went with on this ball is uh, 60 by four and a quarter by 40. Uh, basically to give him a little bit of length and a little bit of a smoother roll in the back. I still want it to be somewhat rolly and a little bit snappy. Uh, but obviously with him switching two-handed, he's gonna want something that's a little bit more controllable. Uh, so we're gonna get this on the press. We're also switching him to vacuum grips. Uh, if I haven't explained this before, basically the top of the hole is a 16th of an inch bigger than the bottom of the hole. So usually it's done uh, with a 31, 30 seconds bit, which is the bottom half of the hole. And then the top side of the hole is done with a one and one 30 seconds bit. So this will go down about an inch from the actual surface of the ball. So let's get this on the drill press, drill that up and get some moving. tripod here so this is drilled up you can see just inside there there's a lip that's very very thin all the way around that's a 16th all the way around the hole and we only sanded off the top of the hole we didn't go down into the bottom of the hole to keep that lip there normally I would mark an X but I'm gonna leave the X off for now just because of the fact that he's just getting this first ball drilled for now uh, I want to make sure that he's comfortable with everything how it feels and then we'll mark the X if we need to we'll also mark it exactly where his palm lays uh, but we're gonna find the grip sizes that he needs. So we have sixes, which is three quarter. 
gonna grab one of those, put it right here. And then we're gonna grab a three and a half, which is 4360 forts. So let's pop these in, make sure they feel okay before you actually get some glued in and then go from there. Alrighty, so Josh dropped off three bowling balls here. Basically, we're gonna take out all the finger inserts. We're gonna fill them all up and then we're gonna redraw all three of these. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and fill all these up right here and then fit his other three down here somewhere. I'm gonna make a little bit more space here. All right, it is Wednesday. Uh, let's go ahead and get the lights turned on. We have to do some fog work. We are cutting this down and resurfacing it, drilling it. We are cutting this down, resurfacing it. We're cutting this down and then filling another spot. Uh, cutting this down, I don't really have to do anything with this immediately. Uh, these three are the ones that Josh left yesterday. So let's get into our Wednesday. Game Breaker 4 release, and as soon as I receive one, we have Chris here, who is going to get this one drilled today. So we have a specs here. We're gonna put this on the drill press and get to throwing some strikes with it. So let's do it. Friday. Got a few people practicing. Shop is open and ready to go. Drink of choice today is uh, Baskin Robbins milkshake. A1, A1 stuff right here. So it is Saturday. It's been a little bit of a quieter morning. I need to clean up in the shop. It's been a little bit of a tough couple days to be able to try to clean. And I have to also resurface this. I'm basically gonna have to go through and I'm gonna have to shave these down uh, with a knife and then screen the whole entire ball to be able to get it really, really smooth. By the way, have you guys ever had ball damage happen to you? Well, this is a ball that I used to throw as my spare ball. I threw that spare ball at a seven pin a couple of years back. Um, and it did not survive. Like it got to the corner of the pin deck and it flew up in the air and then came back down in two pieces. Like a person from the front counter walked up to me and said, hey, does this belong to you? And gave me just the chunk that came off of it. So uh, let me get to it. I'm gonna get that ball damage resurfaced real quick, uh, which is gonna take a lot of screen and a lot of water. So I'm gonna go refill my water bottle and then screen the hell out of that ball. Let's see what happens. All right, real quick, I just wanna thank Dave, Angela, Travis, and Mark, who went to our demo in Louisville, Kentucky. Alex Hambeck just texted me saying that you guys watched the vlog, and I really appreciate you guys giving us the support here on the vlog, and as well in Louisville, Kentucky at our demo day. It means a lot to all of us. So we appreciate you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed your day there, and I hope you guys found the ball that you need for the next league season. Thank you guys. And with that said, make sure you guys go down in the description below. Make sure you guys are going to our demos if you have one nearby you. It's the best opportunity that you can get. You get to throw a whole bunch of different balls that might not be released yet or that are already released that you might have been thinking about getting already. So if you've been having a rough time in leagues or tournaments, go check out our demo program because it could be the refresh that you need. So again, 
down in the description. Make sure you guys hit that. All right, guys, welcome back to Sunday. Uh, we have a few things to do. I'm gonna finish resurfacing a ball, drill that, uh, plug a couple balls that I didn't have time to plug yesterday. Just a little bit busy this morning, taking care of some people that came in. Uh, it's gonna be a kind of a shorter day. Uh, I don't have my lesson today, so it's kind of weird. Uh, we have to fill in this finger. As you can see, we have some cracking here. Uh, so we're gonna fill this in. We're gonna plug it. The ball's tomorrow night, so we gotta get this done tomorrow. Uh, we also have this ball here that apparently won't lock in. I think the bottom near the base is actually too tight, so I'm gonna run a drill bit through this. And then this one, actually, the base isn't all the way in place, so I'm gonna drill that out, put a new one in, and fix that for him. I have a stump slug right here. So, Ryan, cue the time lapse, and uh, let's go with like an R&B kind of music here. I feel like a little bit more mellowed out today, so let's do a little bit more of a relaxed song thing going on here today. So, let's go. Recap of the week, uh, we plugged a lot of stuff, we drilled a lot of stuff, it was a busy week all in all. Thank you guys for supporting all of us. I'm gonna close up shop here, get the lights turned off, locked up and everything, head outside. Thank you for watching episode eight. Make sure you guys hitting that subscribe button and the notification bell. Leave comments down below of what kind of videos you wanna see, what balls you wanna see reviewed outside of the stuff that we already have reviewed. Um, as well as other things like random, you know, pin up, pin down stuff. What would this layout do? What does drilling out a pin do? All those kind of different things. Thank you for watching. Again, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys.